Hello and welcome to CV Tech Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up the OneDrive app on your iPad. This will make printing easier and syncing your files with other devices easier, and also creates a backup in the cloud. We recommend using OneDrive over iCloud because OneDrive works well with Word, PowerPoint, and Excel instead of pages, numbers, and keynotes, and Word, PowerPoint, and Excel works well with your teacher's laptops and iPads. So the first thing we want to do is if we don't already have the OneDrive and Office Suite apps, we can go to self-service if you're at school. If not, if you're at home, we have to go to the App Store. In the self-service, you can go down and find the OneDrive and Word app. Give it a second once it loads. So now that that's loaded, if we scroll down a bit, you can see here we've got Excel, OneDrive, OneNote, PowerPoint, and Word. You can grab all of those, but I've already got those. So we can go home, and we're going to want to open the OneDrive app. And log in with our LearnLink email, not your personal email, not your Gmail, not your Outlook, your LearnLink school email. It ends in at schools.sa.edu.au. If you don't know what this is, um, please go CIT and they'll be able to reset your password and tell you what your email is. It, so now that we've done that, we, when we push next, it'll bring up the LearnLink um, page to log in with. So we'll have to enter our password in, which you obviously won't be able to see and push sign in. So now that we're signed in, it's going to load our OneDrive. If you've never used OneDrive before, it's going to be empty. You have a terabyte of OneDrive storage to store all your schoolwork in. So as we can see here, I've got some recent files, but we don't need to worry about that. And you can see all of your files here with folders. So there's all mine there. But now we want to go to the Files app. So if we go to the Files app, which is found in the dock on an iPad down the bottom here, we click on that. And as we can see on the left, we've got iCloud Drive on my iPad and more locations. We want to go to the top left, edit sidebar, turn off iCloud Drive. We don't want to use iCloud Drive. iCloud Drive doesn't work at school because we don't recommend using that. We recommend OneDrive. We turn OneDrive on and push done. Once we push done, it'll appear here, OneDrive. And if we click on files, there's all the files we saw before. So if you now refer to our other video on how to manage files using OneDrive and the Office Suite, that'll help you set up a file structure ready for school. If you watch another video we have, it'll also show you the easy way to print here at CV High School, as you can't go to AirPrint and select a printer. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.